Hello and welcome to Beard Power. Today we're going to be talking about my favorite topic in Excel, the time saver, the quick access toolbar. Today we're going to take this and turn it into this in under 90 seconds. As always, if you like this video, please like it, subscribe for further content in the future, click this little bell icon to all, that way you'll be notified when I make a new video. Let's jump right into this and let's show you the power of the quick access toolbar. Now that you've seen what the quick access toolbar can do, let's take it back to the beginning. Now that we are back where we started, you'll notice that the quick access toolbar is actually located above your ribbon. To change that below, you click this little button, go to the bottom, and click the option show below the ribbon. To add to your quick access toolbar, you're going to right click within the ribbon on one of the actions. We'll start off with middle line and center. Next we're going to work on the borders, so all borders, and also thick outside border. Following the same order that I had before, we're going to go with wrap text next. After that, filter. To add clear filter, we're going to actually have to put a filter on the spreadsheet. Next we're going to add insert table, that's in your insert tab. We're going to right click, add quick access toolbar. The next two commands I had were row height and column width. You won't be able to find those anywhere within your tab, so your ribbon. So now I'm going to show you another way of adding to your quick access toolbar. So you click within this drop down box, go to more commands. Within here, you can go to all commands, click within, type in row, and there's row height. So I'm going to add that to the quick access toolbar. I'm going to do the same with column width. There are hundreds of different commands that you could add to your quick access toolbar. And if you wanted to, you could use this to populate your whole quick access toolbar. In the interest of keeping this video just a bit shorter, I'm not going to add the remaining commands that I have on my quick access toolbar. But with the 10 that we've added, you can see how much of a time saver it already is. So we can middle align, center align the text all borders, thick border all the way around, wrap the text, add a filter, turn it into a table, adjust the row height to 30, and the column width to 12. And there you go. It already looks way better. The quick access toolbar has saved me hundreds if not thousands of hours. Not everyone uses Excel for the same reason, and for that reason, 
the best way to use the quick access toolbar is to set it up in a methodical sequence that works for you. If you did like the custom layout of my quick access toolbar, but don't want to go through the hassle of adding everything in, I do have something for you. If you send me an email at jacob at beardpower.ca and I'll send you a file that you can quickly upload into Excel to get the exact same quick access toolbar. Once you've saved that file onto your desktop, you can click in back into your drop down box on the quick access toolbar, more commands, import export, you want to import, go to your desktop, click the file, open, yes, okay, and there you have it. Thank you for watching. I'm very excited to hear the success stories after watching this video. Please don't hesitate to comment. And until next time, have an excellent day.